Hello everyone and welcome to Mac Design. Today we will discuss about Class A surfacing. So this is a scan model of a car roof. We'll try to reverse engineer it. So I'll quickly create a rectangular patch over it. Oops. And then we will try to align this patch on the scan model. How to know the distance between these patches that we will talk about today. So first of all, I'll just move these hulls to get a bit close to the scan model. And remember always when you modify the surface, always use the hulls first. Hulls are these lines and when you are a bit close to the scan model, then you have to move on to these points and start modifying them. So I'll skip to the step where I have already aligned this surface to the scan model. So here the surface is aligned to this scan. Now how do we check the deviation? How much is the surface off from this scan? To check that we have this distance analysis. And we have to turn on the shading and then click OK. So you'll see a graph appears here. One second. Let's see how much of our patch is within the 0.1 mm tolerance it's very less so we have to modify the surface until this whole patch becomes green but keeping in mind that we are making an a class surface so what i mean is okay let's just first talk about this distance analysis tool uh, this is the projection from where you can see if you turn on this is the X projection this is in the projection in the Y direction this is in the Z direction and this is the measurement directions delimitation we will discuss in another session because it is a different topic this is a small scale if you click on this this shows you uh, too many scales if you want to look at look at the various colors and the deviations this is the porcupine analysis and you can increase its intensity oops yes so you can see the deviation of the surface Below means the surface is going down, above means the surface is going up. And somewhere between the middle, the surface is quite good. This function is to view the points instead of the shading. You can turn off this analysis. Now it will show the points. You can use this discretization. Oops. To reduce the number of points and more make the model easy to move so like this you can analyze how much close you are to the scan surface now you have to keep one thing in mind when you make the surface your surface has to flow smoothly so as you can see the surface is pretty smooth in this direction also, if I turn on the other direction, this is pretty smooth. So this is quite close to class A surface. We just have to reduce the deviation between the scan. And that's all about time. The amount of time you invest on this, on this patch, the lower the deviation you can get. One thing I would like to tell you is as you can see, the acceleration of the surface here is suddenly increased. So I can predict that 
a sharp fillet is going to come after this. That means if I take the snipping tool, I can predict that the windscreen will come here since the curvature of this is accelerated suddenly. So that's how we make uh, the reverse engineering patch. And this was just a demo video. We'll be discussing these things in a whole lot of detail in the coming sessions. And you want, if you want to visit the full video and the full course, please log on to our website macdesign.in. I'll put the link in the description. And if you have any doubts, just comment below. Thank you.